Hey guys, here we are again. This is uh, going to be part two of the wrist thing. And this is going to be kind of this side. We're not going to do acupuncture on it. Uh, we already did the acupuncture. I've taken out the needles already. Uh, that was another video, which I did the dorsal side. We did large intestine meridian. We did Sanjiao or triple burner. Um, and uh, that was all the ones we did through there. We did some a little bit of muscle work through here. But we're going to do this side because the muscles from in through here, okay, along... Basically, this is the heart meridian comes up this way. And just on the inside of it, you can feel a tendon through here. And that's your, your one of your flexor, okay, ulnaris tendons. We can do like this. And we're going to do two main points. We're actually going to do three parts for the hand. We're going to do one through here, which isn't on a meridian, but we're going to get into the muscle and you're going to see it move. And then we're going to get up through here. Okay, this is two thumbs up is pericardium six. Okay, and then down here is heart. So we have pericardium and heart. Uh, uh, meridians and then we're going to work here on the thumb this is called the thenar eminence and this is like lung 10 would be this one here so we're looking at lung heart and pericardium issues i have this already on and set this is my my handy dandy uh, acupuncture point stimulating electric pen whatever and i've been using this for quite a while on myself mostly i do have people use it and then 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 they can use it themselves but i'll show you so let's go through here there's our two thumb widths okay right there's our pc6 remember this one's good for like nausea and stuff like that if i put i hold this nice and firm and i'll put that right here oh, oh, oh and you can see there we go so as i move it back and forth we're going to catch different parts of the nerve okay right in the middle is where i want it so i can see this finger kind of twitch i feel that all the way up through my hand okay so this is one that's just going to help relax that uh sedate the 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 um basically overpower the meridian and the nerve okay you can see a little bit even in my thumb if you're looking closely i don't think you can see that and we do that for about 10 seconds 10 seconds lightly 10 seconds medium 10 seconds hard and as we go look we go very lightly get a little bit of twitching we go medium more twitching deeper a lot more twitching now it depends on if i roll it side to side i get out here i feel not i feel it still but i get no not as much twitching as i move towards the lateral part to all towards the radius we're going to catch that radial nerve okay now we're going to go also in here lung 10 okay right there in the middle right in the meat and this one is probably going to let it go crazy yeah get in there and this one a lot of tension in this muscle and you can just kind of work a little deeper on this one and this is one we use with our oh there's a little pop uh this is one a lot of people use with their computers uh so this is good for a computer thumb okay right in there let that one go and that one again 10 seconds for 10 count uh surface 10 count medium and 10 count deep Okay. Now, as we work in through this section, this is that heart meridian. We're not, probably not going to find as much. Oh, there we go. Okay. Notice the difference. Okay. I can keep my thumb pinky finger. This is the ulnar nerve. Okay. Get in there. We're going to work this whole set of muscles, which we can see. And that's all this contraction. I don't feel too much on here. I'm nice and my skin is uh, uh, nice and hydrated or moist, as we would say. And we just get a little bit of, you know, the very surfacey, very middle, and very deep. Okay, we work our way all the way up. We get a little bit more, and we're feeling actually the muscles in through here, and we can get in through here and work that one as well. Okay, this is more like it. So heart eight is about right here. There it is, right there. Okay, that's heart eight. I can feel it through the, this side of my pinky and the and the ring finger. Okay, and that's also a, not a bad one. It's a very powerful point. Okay, as we go over in this area, we're going to get ow, 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 ow. We can feel that one a lot more, a little bit more pinchy feel, but we're getting these two. That's PC8, that's pericardium 8, and we go down here, there's 7, and there's uh, 6, okay, right in through here. There we go. So notice we've got thumb, 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 and over here we get um, pinky, 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 okay? So we're getting the whole, the, the palmer or volar surface of the hand and we're catching all of these interosseous muscles and that actually does feel a little better i'm going to go ahead and show you the other ones that we did as well just with this pen we're going to do large intestine uh, uh, four right in through here and we can see the good pulsing right there i see my finger get in there nice and deep hold that one good you gotta have a good grip on this side because otherwise it'll zap you on that side too then we're going to come all the way over across the hand here between the ring finger 
and the pinky finger and right at where it kind of like ends you can feel in there that's the ah, 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 oh man that is the triple burner oh, that's a really good one i feel that one a lot that's actually more intense than the um than the needling that i just finished doing this is oof triple burner sends you out three triple warmer sometimes it's called no no four right on top of the wrist here not much through there but this feels actually quite uh good actually and then we're gonna go five two inches up from there find in through here we're not getting as much because i already did my treatment on here we won't see as much probably and then up through here we're gonna find where's that nine okay we kind of get around dig around in here and you should be able to find that outside so wow so i did a lot of acupuncture on these before um I didn't quite open up this point, it looks like, because that one's still really jumping. I can feel it really well. Let's go in between here just to play, and then between here. So we can also do what's called boxy. We talked about that one right through here, okay? Right through here, and right through here. These are good ones for hand problems. So if you have hand arthritis, you know, hand, wrist, uh, forearm issues, carpal tunnel, uh, thumb issues, anything like that, this is going to help you increase blood flow, increase chi flow, and improve range of motion. And it's going to help you also, because you're stimulating it, help you reduce inflammation, uh, at least some temporarily. Now, of course, you can take all kinds of things with it. Um, you can take different herbal uh, anti-inflammatories. You can take... Uh, um, you can also take um, like turmeric is a really good one. Ginger is a really good one. Uh, ginseng, those are also, those are very good. But this, uh, we want to keep warm. Okay, this is also from cold weather, right? We're using our hands in cold weather. Uh, me as a chiropractor, acupuncturist, I'm doing a lot of stuff with my hands, uh, manipulating tissues and, and, and finding little very subtle trigger points with my hands. Um, and also I do a lot of typing you know, and a lot of mouse work. Here's my mouse again, right? There's my mouse. I use this a lot and I get a lot of tension through here and here because I'm moving these guys around. I don't do this much because this has a trackball, which I like. Anyway, this is um, Dr. Sean over at the, the Natural Body Works. Don't forget to, so, to like, subscribe because I have other videos. Watch the previous video where I did the acupuncture on the, the, the dorsal service as well, okay? Um, you guys take good care of yourselves and we'll see you soon.